There we go. Thank you, Fenris. Nice. Let him have it. You need to die. Come on, now this is a fight. Beautiful. Varric? Is that you? Praise the ancestors. Hold up. I know this man. He's Bartran Stewart. Hmm. Hugin, what happened here? Eric, your brother. That statue he brought out of the deep roads. Bartran said it sang to him, even after he sold it. Sang to him? I've been hiding in here, but the guards, they're like crazed animals. I didn't dare go past them. Everyone in this house has gone mad. Huh. What did he do to the guard to turn them to this? He's been forcing them to eat lyrium. Some of the servants, he cut pieces off them while they were still alive. Ah. Oh. He says he's trying to help them hear the song. Please stop him. That's... Bartran's not exactly a nice guy, but this doesn't sound like my brother. Yeah, that's kind of... that's really disturbing. I haven't seen anyone alive in here except for guards. What happened to the rest of the staff? I don't know what Bartran did to them. By the ancestors. The sound's coming from his study. They're dead by now. I hope. Oh. What do you mean you hope they're dead? Mm -hmm. Just whoever... Whatever you find in that room. Varric, give them a merciful death. Yeesh. That's not... That's pretty foreboding. You said he sold the statue. To who? I don't know. It's why we came back to Kirkwall. He was already starting to rant about the sodding idol and his singing. Mm -hmm. On his better days, he hated the thing. Wanted to get rid of it. But the minute it was gone, he got worse. Huh. I assume you mean he's crazy, not just very upset. He's hearing things, seeing things, talking to someone who's not there. That's when he's feeling good. Like a demon? Bartran took the servants and locked himself inside the study. No one's come out for days. Oh. And those sodding lunatics just keep prowling the halls. Then we go in after him. Come on, Hawk. Let's finish this. Righto. Right after we loot. The rest of Varric's... Um, the rest of Bartran's stuff. Um. Yes. Loot this guy. Loot this guy. Priorities. Come on, Varric. Priorities. I can't talk to Hugin anymore. Robes. Okay. Hmm. Is there anything in here? I don't think so. Maybe we should have Varric go first since he can find traps and stuff. Oh no, this is where we came from. No, I don't want to go in this way. It came from this way. That takes us to the center hall. That takes us to High Town. Um, we already searched this area. Here's some doors we haven't looked through yet. Oh. Miss, almost missed the crate. What's in here? Bartram, what have you done? Oh my gosh. Yeesh. Raven feather, crate, complex chest. Superior boots, black and greaves. Easy as buy. Silver bar, okay. Sheesh. There's something about that idol that's just messing up with Bartran even more more than he's already is messed up.
belt of the primeval. Actually, what does that thing do? You look pretty cool. Plus four percent fire damage, cold damage, interesting nature damage. Eh, it's all right. Probably about, probably worth more selling than handcrafted gilt long coat. Ooh, nice. I'm wondering if I can wear this. Put this on, Varric. Yes, I can. Purple. Huh. I like that. Nice royal purple, or amethyst, um, coloring there. Keep your guard up. These guys play He's dirty. What the? All right. Well, I want the chest. Boots of the overseer. Oh, nice. So that's our new. Um, I think the overse the armor of the overseer is our next um, set, armor set. I think. The Overseer was a nickname given to Magister Claudian, Verantus, the last and perhaps the most notorious of those assigned to the Maharian Jetstone Quarry outside of Kirkwall, now known locally as the Bone Pit. The, ba the Magister was known for his sadistic cruelty. His malevolent social experiments were designed to make examples of those who disobeyed him. Verantus even noted that feeding slaves to his pet dragonlings was little more than they deserved. The slave revolt in 25 Ancient put an end to the Overseer. He was assaulted by a mob of slaves who stripped his enchanted robes and threw Verantus into the bone pit to be feasted upon by his dragonlings. What became of his robes during all the chaos is unknown, but it is assumed they remain in Kirkwall. From Kirkwall, the City of Chains by Brother JTV 924 Dragon. I don't know if I want to wear this armor now. Bartrand? Oh, Bartrand. We need to talk. Bartrand, come back here. Alright, you, sir, need an entropic cloud. Ow! And. Oh, where did he go? Oh no, Bartrand just disappeared. That's annoying. Alright, well, we'll take care of his baddies first, then. There's Bartrand. Oh, no! Bartrand just took down Varric! Alright, that's it. Um... Yeah, Bartrand, you need to go down. Disappeared again. That is so annoying. We need to take these guys out fast. Oh, jeez. All right. Heal, heal, Anders, heal. Now, thank you. Tank him, tank him, Fenris. I know you're not really a tank, but you're gonna you're gonna tank him anyway. Gotcha. Bring back Beric. Regroup. Chugga chugga chugga. There we go. Uh, Beric, injury kit. Bartrand. Take a potion. All right. You can't use a potion yet. Come on, Fenris, keep it up. Soften him up more. Oh, Fenris. 
Fenris still can't. Kite him, kite him, kite him. Thank you. Now come back for more. Ooh. I can't hear it anymore. I just need to hear the song again. Just for a minute. Stop saying that. I know I shouldn't have sold the idol to that woman. It was a mistake. A mistake. Parchment, get a hold of yourself. Do you know where you are? Do you know what you've done? Back. You'll help me, won't you, little brother? Help me find it again. You were always a good one. What are you talking about? Help you. Bartrand, you left me to die. You left all your men to die. And for what? Some trinket? Yeah. Look at yourself. Look at what you've done to the men and women who served you. Where's your nobility, brother? Where's your dwarven honor? Anders, sweetheart. C can you do something? Can you do something, sweetheart? This doesn't feel natural. If he wasn't a dwarf, I'd think a demon did this. His mind has been poisoned by something powerful. That's all I can do. It won't last, I'm sorry. That's my man. Varric? I'm here. Varric, what have I done? I don't know. I honestly don't know. Make it stop, little brother. Don't let me... Don't let House Tetris fall like this. I know. I don't deserve it. But please, Varric, don't leave me like this. Make it stop. Enough with the speeches. I'll get you to a healer, and you'll be fine. This is tough. I mean, Clive, he's requesting for Varric to put him out of his misery. He's, he's specifically asking him to, but I think for now, Clive wants to see if there's anything they can do for him. It makes sense for us to see if there's anything we can do for him first, and then if nothing seems to be helping, if it really looks like Bartrand's suffering, then we can put him out of his misery. I don't think we should jump... I don't think Clive wants to jump into putting him out of his mid or his misery right then and there. So, let's get him out of here. We can probably carry him. You want to take his arms while I take his legs? I'll send someone to come get him. Sit tight, brother. Help is on the way. Come on, Hawk. The sooner we get out of this house, the better. All this for a crazy idol. Red Earth Long One. Red Earth Long One. Yeah, Boots of the Overseer. I think that's the first of the set. So we still have a ways to go. Um, is that a... Oh, Red Earth Long One. Huh. Aveline might like this one. Okay. Thank you, Bartrand. There. I can't hear the song anymore. It's alright, we'll take care of it. 